Oh, look at that. Look at that, dude. Oh, oh, look at that. Suicide grunts and colony guys. This is definitely it right here. This is the exact same thing I did in the last video. Oh, and the suicide grunts just obliterated my army. GG. What's good, everybody, and welcome back to another Halo Wars 2 video. Super excited because today we're playing Consano. This is the first video that I've actually done with Consano. And I have a rough build order idea. I know I want to go for her warthogs, but that's about all I know. <laughs> so I started three supply pads and one generator. I'll tell you what, guys, I've been loving Halo Wars 2. This has just been a ridiculously fun game. All right, so we got our jackrabbit. I kind of want to go just have a peek and see what our opponent is doing. All right, so it looks like he's open two supply pads, one generator. Not a whole lot else. He's going for... Oh, he thinks I'm doing a rush. Nice. You know, that's actually not a bad idea. I can rush over there, make him get a little bit fearful. No, I'm not doing a rush, dude. There's no rush. Looks like he hasn't expanded either. Cool. So we're going to end up taking this tower here. And at 1,000 energy, we are going to upgrade to our level 2. Part of the reason I've been having so much fun with Halo Wars 2 is just primarily because I'm not taking it too seriously. Um, I'm just sitting back, relaxing, playing it at my own kind of pace. Not, not overly stressed about um, win-loss or anything like that. Just trying to have fun, creative builds to show off to you guys. That's really it. All right, now I want to get double garage. I want to make sure that I'm getting my supply pad there. Oh, we got some enemy units here that we could... Uh... And now we back up because he has built advanced. He's, he's playing very careful. All right, I agree with that, dude. I know some folks have complained about search times. I've actually not experienced any bad search times whatsoever for this game. And we'll grab in our expansion. I should have grabbed my natural expansion there. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah. And just continuous warthog building here until we get to 1500 energy. Nice. And then there's our expansion. So, looking good. I wanna make sure that I keep map presence because this style of build, um, I have a very mobile ar army, and that's going to be probably my biggest advantage is the mobility of my army. Just making sure, too, that he's not taking more than I think that he should be taking kind of a thing. So we'll get rid of that. What is this? What is this warthog doing? It does not know what to do. <laughs> How to warthog? I don't know. Okay, we're going to get turret call down. By the way, I've gotten turret call down, red line one, and heat of battle. Okay, and we'll start upgrading some of our stuff to get additional resources over here. And we're gonna upgrade now to the tier three base so we can get our uh, extra upgrade over here. We're also gonna build a Consano Cyclops, which is uh, the hero unit. Oh, wow, the Flame Hogs shoot air units. I did not know that. Nice, we got Consano. So this is Consano's mech. It's really cool looking. Consano Cyclops, I should say. Grab our incendiary grenade upgrade there. And we're gonna get her Flame Wall upgrade as well, which lets her do this really cool flame attack. I'm sort of feeling attacking his secondary base and then trying to lure him into a really big ambush. Yeah. So he's going all Marines, it looks like. And all right, here we go. Kinsano flame wall right here. Bro, look at the fire. Look at all the fire. It's crazy. Flame warthog drop. Turret drop. More warthogs. Yes, please. So far, so good, everybody. So far, so good. Nice. One more turret, and we're done. One more turret, and it's all ogre. All units. Nicely done. Kinsano is still alive. Let it rip. Let it rip, Kinsano. Flame wall! Flame wall! This game is so cool, dude. It's, like, really, really, really pretty. Just gotta keep... We're gonna upgrade our population. This is super fun, dude. All right, boys. Let it rip. Flame wall at Kinsano. Oh, look at that. Look at that, dude. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, man, that's so sweet. All right, we're going to max out one more time, and then we'll go in for the final strike. All right, turret drop. It's a go. Boosh! Let it roll, baby. Let her roll. Flame Warthog drop on the way. Inferno creates a huge burning area on the battlefield. Let's do it. In ultimate power away. Oh! Oh, that's awesome. Oh, that's so cool. GG, man. What an awesome DLC leader, man. That is... 
That is really cool. I'm gonna use Kinsano some more. I, I like Colony, but I think... I think Kinsano might offer more, like, of a, a well-rounded kit than perhaps Colony, but I don't know. I don't know enough about those games, so... Thanks for watching so much. If you enjoyed this video, please drop a like. I highly enjoy making these. This is a lot of fun. If you have suggestions for a leader or a build or something to try out next time, let me know. I'm into all sorts of crazy, wonky, weird builds or just, like, just trolley things. Totally up for it. Thanks and have a good day.